I'm not good at coming on and like showing my outfit when I actually go somewhere. I told you guys I was going out. It's girls' night. This is my outfit. I bought this romper from Fashion Nova. Let's show you guys in the mirror before I make some milk for Mia. So cute. It's full leather. So very cute. So we're going out for a little girl's night. Well, it's a co-worker's event, so yeah. Hello everyone, happy Sunday. I'm currently in the kitchen. Last night I told, I told you guys that I was going to that party and I did go and it was so good. It's nice always meeting up with the girls and you know, having just a good little night, especially um where there are no mom requirements because i feel like i'm always 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 here with mia and always appearing first so that was pretty good right now i made some oatmeal um and i'm putting it out in these little containers for her for the next couple of mornings that way when i come home some of the mornings could be a little bit easy as far as you know breakfast is already figured out because sometimes i make other things and she doesn't want it she would like prefer to eat some oatmeal or whatever so i went ahead and did that this morning i made a decent sized pot of oatmeal and now that it's cool i'm putting it into some little containers so that's what we're doing right now One thing Mia is going to do is have all them toys going off at different intervals inside here. There's food in the fridge for like lunches and dinners and this is five containers for like the next five mornings because again i'm going to be working so i'm trying to make it a little bit easier when i come home in the mornings uh mainly because when i come home in the mornings me wants to um mia will be waiting up for me when i come home in the mornings literally just or not even waiting up but like when i come home in the mornings she wakes up after i get here like a few minutes after i get here sometimes and she will open the bedroom door that you guys can see from like all the way down there and she will like just stand there and look essentially if she sees me in the kitchen and i love that she um does that in the mornings it's the cutest thing ever so we have these extra containers left today's sunday today's trash day so whatever's underneath here without a cover i'm tossing already went ahead and organized some stuff up underneath there so now these are gonna go in the fridge I'm pouring out whatever's left instead of this milk. And we're going to throw out this bottle because, again, today is trash day. And when it is trash day, I like to make sure that all of the excessive things go outside. There are some little bottles sitting here on the counter, and I'm not to throw them away too. The living room closet there's a bag in there that i had given my mom with like some shorts when she was leaving the last time she ended up leaving them here and i'm throwing them away that's when i was going through my closet and like taking off things that couldn't fit me and i gave her them to do whatever she wants with them more than likely she'd have sold them and she left them so now i'm tossing them because this apartment is not the biggest apartment so you need all of this space that you can get and she left them and they're taking up space inside of that little closet in there. So I'm getting rid of them. So hopefully that space can be used for something else just whenever. Okay. Don't take it down, honey. Mia. Also, this living room looks crazy. This car, your dad has not taken you or the car outside not once. And I'm telling you, I'm giving it a hot six months before I throw it away because it's just taking up space at this point. I 
don't know, her godmother, Auntie Jules, bought her this ABC mat uh, some time ago. And it was lovely and it served us for quite a while. But now, um, it's always getting messy and like messed up on the living room floor and makes the living room look a little bit untidy and that bothers me. So I ended up taking it up off of the living room floor and leaving the rug on the living room floor as is. So now we're going to have to just keep it until we find a place for it. And then if not, unfortunately, we'll have to throw it out. But like I said, during her like teeny tiny baby stages where she would have needed the extra cushion, it worked. So um, love that. So there is a possibility that it also may have already served its purpose. But I don't want to throw it out just yet, just in case I find reasons to use it again. So we're putting it up here. Okay, let's not be wasteful. Let's not throw them away. I'll put it back. Maybe when my friend comes back from vacation, I'll walk with them one day and see if we can find a clothing bin to drop them off and to donate them. Because let's face it, people are in shelters who are less fortunate and can't afford some things and would really use something like that. I just put a little spray on this again to hold it down again i'm gonna put the band back down on the front because i do go to work tonight but i also think oh this is a spray that my friend gave me so good i mean we're boycotting a bit but she, the girl already gave it to me and i don't have anything else to use today i was saying i would go on erica j's website and i would get something from there but we'll see we'll see no thank you honey no thank you my love she understands no thank you as far as no thank you don't do that or no thank you i don't need help with that and she understands thank you in the concept of give that to me i'll take it from you thank you so whenever you tell her thank you she will give you something but also she will say thank you when you give her something as well which is so cute and so good oh um, yeah i need to sit down and and like read up on psychology because now I'm doing psychology and English but I bought the psychology textbook and I'm waiting for for them to mail it to me and I, I haven't received it yet but I need to do some reading and so far I have not done that great I'm gonna drink some water I'm gonna turn the air on I mean the air is on in the bedroom I think I'm gonna just go in the bedroom bring the paper and see if I can do a little bit of reading on psychology for now I want to wipe the floors but I'll do it later when I put me in her high chair